Hi, this is Devin Hobb with Remax, and we're in Vineyard today in the Water's Edge community. There's a low HOA fee for this master plan community, and it includes two clubhouses with swimming pools, and we're very close to one of them, just right here. The other one, there's a neighborhood walking path that goes out this way, and it goes to the west, and there's a big grass strip. You can walk through that grassy area over to a big 16 acre park that also has a swimming pool, a hot tub, a fitness center, and there's zip lines, tennis, pickleball, basketball, and a splash pad and pavilions and everything. So really awesome park that way in a nice clubhouse with a swimming pool, more specific to this area right here. And it's all walking distance. So Water's Edge is a really nice community. Uh, I'm gonna take you in to this home and give you a good feel for the layout. Um, this one is a three car garage and this house is special. It has a legal accessory basement apartment. We have the document approved by the city to have a legal rental basement, which means you can live in upstairs and rent out the basement to anybody you'd like. There's a separate entrance down this way and it goes to the, to the basement entrance. Um, market rent, it's a two bedroom basement uh, apartment and Market rent should be somewhere around $1,400. All right, so here in the entryway, we do have a front formal living room or office, or they use it as a playroom. And this way we've got the open great room. Uh, there's nine foot tall ceilings, and they had these custom shelves put in, and a nice gas fireplace. Now this, this home is been, has been upgraded in the kitchen. And so they've upgraded this kitchen to the double ovens with the microwave on top. The fridge will be included. So you can have the fridge both up here on the main floor and in the basement apartment. Um, they did custom tile backsplash. We have a gas countertop stove with a nice hood. So anyway, very deluxe kitchen. Right here we've got the walk-in pantry and it's a pretty good size and then the dining room space. So it's nice that this has the more triangular great room instead of a bowling alley that goes kitchen, dining, living. It, it, it makes it kind of more open like this. So let's go upstairs. Actually, wait, we got another half bath back here. So we have a half bath here, a coat closet right here, and then we have the three car garage, which is a standard three car and then access to the basement. So we'll go upstairs now. All right, so up here we've got a full bathroom here with shiplap on the walls and uh, this bathroom serving the upstairs bedrooms. And we have bedroom number one and we have bedroom two right here, which is currently kind of an office with custom trim work. And then we've got bedroom three and uh, these bedrooms all have good sized closets as well. They, uh, they're extra wide. The, the rooms are not small, they're, they're good size. So then that brings us over here to the master. So this master is very spacious, has vaulted ceilings, custom trim work on the walls. And then we've got upgraded flooring. We have the 12 by 24 tile on the floor and Throughout the whole house, the kitchen and all the bathrooms have this uh, extra thick quartz countertops. Walk-in shower with the Euro glass. And then a very large master closet, which is awesome. Um, this is a really neat feature here. So this is access to the laundry room. So we have the, the laundry here. They're gonna keep their washer dryer, but you can access the laundry room from right here as well. So this is at the top of the stairs. And so you can, the whole main, the whole upstairs has access to laundry here and also from your private master bath. All right, so now we'll head downstairs to the basement apartment. All right, so here we're going down to the basement apartment. The door at the top could be locked and this could be completely separate. We've got a cold storage area right here. 
And then right here is the washer dryer for the basement apartment. The ba these belong to the current renter and so they will be leaving. And this is bedroom number one. And we've got the living room here. And just so you know, the renter is going to move when this home sells. So this will be all empty for you. Uh, it's currently uh, family staying here. And this is bedroom number two. And we've got the full bath for the basement apartment with granite countertops. And then this kitchen has the extra granite countertops. Uh, they upgraded the sink to the single basin sink. And uh, the fridge will stay. Stainless appliances will all stay except for this countertop one. And then there is a closet here that could either be more pantry space or a coat closet. Um, and then this is the separate entrance. We'll go out here and just show you the backyard from here. It's a nice sized backyard and uh, they've put in a nice deck here. Really nice deck. It's a Trex style material, like a vinyl, uh, vinyl boarding that is maintenance free. And uh, over here you'll see that there's two AC units. So they have heat and cooling for the main floor and upstairs. And then the basement apartment has its own thermostat to be able to heat and cool itself separately. Um, and then we'll go back inside here. I hope you enjoyed watching a video tour of this home and got a good feel for the layout as well as some of the features. If you'd like to come and see it in person, feel free to reach out to me or reach out to the agent you're already working with and have them show you this home. Thanks for watching.